Hello everyone and today I'm going to tell you about one my walking out with a friend. One day after work I decided to go and to watch uh, on some new station in our subway just to see some new station which was opened recently. It's a new one Metroline and almost all station would were made with new materials and new architecture visions. So it was really easy for me to agree on this ride. Uh, first of all, I should say that uh, all this top, based on subjective opinion and first impressions, which I and my friend experienced when we were on these subway stations. Okay, top 10 subway station of Moscow subway. Let's go! Okay, 10th place. This place uh, is shared by three different uh, metro stations, which is called CSKA, uh, Petrovsky Park and Khrushchevska. Just because all these three stations are very similar. They all have the same type of columns, they all have uh, the same ceiling decoration above walking zone and the same uh, ceiling construction above uh, train lines. But these stations have their own charm. Simple, good solution. And I think these words I could relate to general concept of these stations. And the next one, ninth place. And there is no butter sky station. Um, the station on the first blush not really interesting, especially when you just arriving on the station and see all the space uh, from train. But when you walking along this station, you dip in this special atmosphere. There is not something notable like um, there is very usual walls, very usual columns and even ceiling very ordinary. But when you walk along the station, you dip in some cozy atmosphere with these yellow and orange slab boards and uh, grey brown walls. I think this made me remember like I'm strolling along old narrow by street and some housewives are folding uh, their laundry and you just go through all this hanging fabric and it's a summer, it's good weather, <laughs> yeah, very interesting mood. And the next one, 8th place, Kuntsevska station. say this station is not very ordinary definitely but when I was at this station I feel like I'm in some George Orwell's novels 1984 mm. honestly this station had so much pressure on me there uh, weren't much space, there is no space, just because all these columns were so thick and they uh, took so much space and you just like very tiny uh, detail of all these spaces. And there was only one dominant color, it's grey, so it's not 
brightly light gray it's very hard gray but yeah it's really an interesting solution especially these lights uh, which uh, look similar with uh, columns uh, which are here it's like a half of, of column and interesting solution very interesting and i think if space creates special atmosphere it will work and the next one seventh place and it is Minyovka station this station interesting with this posters characters walls was made really neatly and the title of the station was put a few times in different position of walls and it is already not ordinary solution uh, but the most interesting thing on the station i think it's something resembling um, gate or maybe arc in the middle of the station you all could see it immediately just because it's big and it's red yeah gray white surrounded and red arc right in the middle of the station now honestly it's remind me tory gates and i found these lights very nice really look at this the next one sixth place and there is a Minivska station so give to architects parametric design and they will love it this station have really unattractive walls panels and uh, very simple ordinary columns just straight and dark but <laughs> the ceiling looks gorgeous it have simple metal structure construction and it's have simple pattern of motion yeah i have just trolled along all the station with head up it's like a metal waves which just hang above you and there is fifth place and it's maturinsky prospect two words china town yeah it's like a chinatown underground <laughs> red columns these uh, slab boards with traditional chinese pattern and it works really when you are here you feel this atmosphere like you in one moment find yourself in cozy chinese street it's a really interesting walk along the station our next position in this top fourth place honestly this station would be on the first place of this top if don't these walls but there are beautiful columns and uh, really good uh, space organization oh of course of course this ceiling oh my gosh i've mentioned before about parametric design i think it's like a beautiful gorgeous brilliant design of ceiling yeah seriously it reminds me uh something like typewriter and there are top three subway station and the third place the big of a subway station the 
first what you could see on the station, of course, this beautiful bus reliefs, which is nice to look at. And of course, these brightly orange columns with this graphic picture. It's really interesting station. And additionally, you really intuitively understood where you should go because you see all these crossings and exits. The second place of this stop it's Sabelovska Subway Station. I really love when you could see all this structure of some objects and this is it. The whole station almost don't have any finishing. Walls are which a long train station without any finishing. With only title on them, you could see all this metal structure. Even the substructure on platform uh, don't have anything on them except these uh, glass panels which covered it and you could see all the structure but can't touch it and this is so incredible and unusual and there is the first place of our top drum and bass it is Terehova station Woo! station like a candy. When I was there, I feel this strong feeling that I'm in confectionery. This station have so light and discreet design. There are only one type of walls panel, but oh my gosh, what is the type? It's a fibred concrete and it's so tangible. You could touch it again and again and oh my gosh, I so much love it. I think this station have simple and full value space where you could feel you comfortable. Okay, there were top 10 subway station of one metro line. I hope it was useful for you and will help you to become a little bit better than you were yesterday. Bye-bye!